British-Australian actress Miriam Margulis, who is best known for her outrageous sense of humour, has admitted she was appalled at her own rudeness after launching into a foul-mouthed rant about Chancellor of the Exchequer Jeremy Hunt live on air. This time last year, she appeared on BBC Radio 4's The Today programme, where she voiced a very strong and rude opinion of Jeremy Hunt without realising her microphone was on. At the time of the slip-up, Miriam shocked listeners by saying, F asterisk, asterisk U, B asterisk, 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 asterisk D, after his appearance on Radio 4 just one day after he was announced as the replacement for ex-Chancellor Kwasi Kwarteng. The Harry Potter star has appeared on The Graham Norton Show, which airs this evening, to promote her new book, O oh Miriam. Speaking about her embarrassing radio blunder, she admitted, I would never swear on Radio 4 because to me it is a temple. I truly didn't know what I had done. I was shocked and appalled at my own rudeness. It was upsetting. Last October, Miriam had been invited onto the BBC's Today programme to speak about the sad death of her Harry Potter co-star Robbie Coltrane. She informed hosts Martha Kearney and Justin Webb that she had greeted Conservative MP Jeremy when he was coming out of being interviewed just before her. She confessed, when I saw him, Jeremy Hunt, there, I just said, what a hell of a job, the best of luck. And what I really wanted to say was, F asterisk, asterisk, U, B asterisk, 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 D, but you can't say that. Justin immediately apologized for Miriam's shocking admission, frantically interjecting, Oh, no, 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 you mustn't say that. No, you can't say that. We'll have to have you out of the studio now. Discussing her new book, which is a follow-up to This Much Is True, she explained, It's not quite as rude as the first one. Because I wanted to talk about the more serious part of my life, so people don't just think I am a maniac. I am a real person.